Hi, my name is Rich Fernandez. I'm the Senior Vice President for Ambulatory Services at the Brigham and Women's Hospital. We're conveniently located just down the street in the Longwood Medical Area Center. We have a long history of innovation, both in the clinical sense, in terms of uh, uh, surgical medical procedures into biotech and pharmaceuticals, but it's really the fabric of who we are. So the pitch that we have for you today is something that's near and dear to my heart about outpatient slot utilization or how well do we use our physician time, which is our most expensive resource at the Brigham. Today we have about 10% of our patients who don't show up for an appointment and about 5% of patients that cancel appointment within three days of the scheduled uh, appointment. That amounts to somewhere between 1,000 and 1,500 patients every week. Why is that important? It's a dissatisfier to our uh, providers whose appointment lengths are anywhere from 15 to 60 minutes, so they're sitting in clinic without uh, a patient, not being able to care for some. For our patients, it's important because we have a, a, a pretty long lag time to get to see some of our world-renowned specialists, and for 1,500 patients, that's 1,500 patients that we could have gotten in this week that may be booked out you know two three weeks uh, so it's really inefficient it's a dissatisfier to our patients a dissatisfier to our providers we know they're uh, engaging with uh, organizations out there like here at the at the mass challenge there are companies that can meet our patients either digitally through their phones through our internet integrated with our hospital information systems uh, to help solve this uh, why work with us again we have uh, our CEO, Beth, Dr. Betsy Nables, is convinced and engaged in making innovation uh, that we're, we become the model for kind of digital health. We have an innovation hub that's sole purpose is funded by the hospital to help drive innovation, particularly on the IT side. We were one of the early adopters of um, uh, medical interactions in uh, kind of our homegrown electronic medical record. So we have a real history of doing this and we're looking forward to the next phase, hopefully with a company out there like you.